in the middle. Emily, she's kind of one of these big players. So duelist, and she's up quick, but so is Benita. Pushing down into mid, she'll find Ari. But Emily's trying to wrap back into play here, ready, but the alarm bot still doubles the damage on her, and it makes it easy for Animal. Now, Zoe has a spike down on B, and they're actually going for the CT side take. We've seen them do this a couple times. They're ready to fight Flash up. Here it comes, and the blind is perfect for Kath to get one a second as well now for the TSM players, and they have this into even odds. Chobo, a little nervous to keep pushing as Athena finds one on site. So suddenly, CLG, they find themselves at a disadvantage. Benita is up on the site, but Utility still keeps her at bay. A dink from Zoe, and the turret could even finish her off here. Chobo, though, Holding up top. I don't think they have utility left, so they have to fight. They get her off the spike. One up top, and Chobo finds one, but the trade good through. TSM, how did they pull that off? Weapon. Let's see if she can do anything with it. Benita also has a shotgun of her own, and Animal gets that first one. In comes Benita, spamming away, but they're ready. Animal still has the trade for even odds. With Zoe and her eyes will recover that ever-present eye on Bucky, but the utility spamming away. Keeping her eyes at bay for now. She wants to peek out, they want the spike down, and Naomi stops that for now, but Emily has the trade back. A two-on-two, two. so close, and Chobo has the HP to peek out here, but a dark cover keeps them away for now. Spike's still on the floor, it's not even in the ground, and they're pushing out, but Kath finds it, closes that up for TSM. Benita got a quickie eel here, though, so it's like she's all fresh and washed up. Lead by one with the breach at half HP. This could be dangerous for TSM, although CLG is on a really weak five. Just the fact that all of CLG is ready for that corner and that paranoia is going to come in. It's not a paranoia, my bad. The dark cover, and look at this. The kills are getting exchanges all in the ends of Irie here in a one versus three. Trap behind the box now, needs to fight her way out, has the first, but so much damage done. Now into a one-on-two, and a flank is of opportunity soon. Here comes the op from Benita, good for one. That's Emily, taken out of the round, and she wants to keep fighting, but the player in hell is gone, but the flank from Animal comes through, and CLG, they, they just take it away. Yeah, they are playing the slow, playing it safe now. And they have a lot of territory to work with into the middle. Heaven still will be the place to execute. The flash is up, but it doesn't hit Benita. So she dismisses away. An animal's ready, powered up by the blind, but still, Zoe finds it. Now the Killjoy lockdown in play. This will keep them off the 45 seconds to work with, though. A rotation is possible, but they have to call soon. And out comes the push. Ari holding tight, trying to hold the line, but Benita's there. And so is Naomi. They each get one of their own, and Kath... 30 seconds left. 30 seconds I think left. she'll have time if she runs it to A, but still a 1v3. This is tough stuff. Really? And there's not much she can do, and she's going to have to try to go aggressive here and find in these one versus one. We have one player low onto CLG. It's Benita. Yeah, and that's the first she's one. That's the huge. First one to fall. Yeah. yeah that's great for Kath. Because now she has this a little more set off. The wall buys her time to position herself in the site. She needs another fight, gets one. Now she can back away, still full HP. A one versus one here now. This shouldn't be winnable, but Kath is making it work behind. They're ringing around the Rosie, and I'm not sure if they saw the tail end. Still searching on the site. Kath circling around. Shark in the water, up behind, they'll hear it, Chobo forced off the spike, time so low, and Kath is still kicking it, she'll just win it off the time, how does she pull that off, a one versus three, that seemed in hasn't really found the answer yet, eight rounds in. No oh, real solution. Here comes the Rolling Thunder, though. This allows them to push into heaven. But look at the ramp present from CLG. There's two here. Ready. Paranoia up. Blinds one. Chobo holds close. Ready for the frag. And she'll get it onto Ari. Annie Maul, another CLG. Picking up the pace here. The flash is good, but the shot does it very well. Possibly a chance here at Zoe's head. Just tantalizing around the corner. And TSM, they're still just playing the contact here, playing for the space. And Emily, you said she was having a tough one, and the odds get no better as she is taken immediately out. Annie Mall now holding in close. Resurrection is in her back pocket. And the direction for TSM seems to be A, this is the right call, but look at all the utility. And look where Bonita is. 
she's ready to get some entry frags and what was that tina doing i'm not quite sure she had her knife out not ready and expecting Rita to be there at heaven and clg still up number even with that resurrection and lots of alt in play here to secure that b-bomb site have a look at the flank coming in it's huge from chobo for two frags now spike down push and this is where benita might get overwhelmed here yeah she wants a shot here and she gets it the tightest line emily having no good luck in her fortunes Hari has the refrag though but look where annie mall is this is so sneaky who would ever expect it not athena <laughs> Annie Mall betters her, and a 4v3 now. A work back in for CLG Red and TSM. It feels it's been ages since a post fight for them, but they still aren't finding the success they need. Zoe towards main, they're playing off the spike from that position. She might even go for a flank. But CLG, they're ready on this retake, and out comes the showstopper. They're going in quickly. Rocket connects. That's Ari taking care of Kath. She's the only woman on site. She needs to go big here and can't even find one. Zoe, she's late to the show, rotating up a dark cover on the spike. And at this point, she's trying to spam, but she can't do it. Yeah. I mean, it's exactly what we expect. But Ari picks up that first frag over towards the A site. So a good start for TSM. But they again have to capitalize off of it. We see CLG sneaking their way into the vents. They're looking for... Something of an A split here. Athena's up top. Now she's getting pinched in from two angles. And the trade is through from Rise. Now Ari in here to hold the cross. A push out from Chobo. Spam's going both ways. Nothing connecting. She has to hide from the blast pack so it doesn't kill her. But Kath gets one. Felled as well. And Ari has to push quickly trying to do something with Chobo. Will best her in the flank through from Benita. One. The overheal coming up. She's so low. And Zoe will find it. Now one on two. Doable for Zoe. She knows at least one is held. Will she expect two? Now she'll see that they're both here. Has one blind to work with. This could be huge. Both can't see the spam going every which way. Oh, Zoe can't find the no. shots. Now she has one bullet. Has to reload. Chobo hopping up and over. It's chaos. Nothing's going right except for that. Zoe. How much utility from TSM? Yeah, a lot for them. In this one. But Naomi has an entry onto Athena. Ori now trying to hold tight towards hell. She does have the judge, though. The weapon for the job. And she'll find the first. She can recover a gun now if, if she can get over the ledge. Yeah. All right. She figured it out. Got it going now. But Benita gets Kath unsuspecting. Ori still low. Finds one looking for more. Can't do it. Three on two. But Zoe has the rolling thunder up. This is a doable rebound, but Chobo Ooh. is in such a good spot. Finds one, but oh, no, actually no. doesn't. Zoe, quicker, and now the Rolling Thunder can come out. Actually, they might not lose it here. Are they going to? Yes, here it comes. One in main. They have to deal with Benita, but she's just diggling out, taking these taps one by one. And Zoe, at this point, there's nothing she can do. That fault line actually might get one killed, but regardless, CLG rep. Eyes towards mid, looking for the turret, looking for something, but the flash is good, and the push up from Chobo finds one, Nade takes care of Rise on the trade back from Emily, but here comes the showstopper, however, CLG, they're still in middle, I mean, everyone pushed away, it's not going to find them anything, yeah. nor will it pick up any space stuff, so this is a four on four. And TSM, I mean, they're not going to be happy with this quite yet. They need information. They're starved of it. And Athena might get more than info. She gets an onslaught of three. Still good to find one. Emily up in heaven. Looking for a shot. She knows that they could... Hey, but we're going to have to see a three versus three retake. As the bomb is going to get planted towards... And this is where CLG really struggles on their post plant. And again, they're giving a lot of room. They're trying to retake that mid, but I don't know. Oh, it's for the res, maybe. Oh, no. This is this is a tough spot for TSM. Look how much time is being wasted mm -hmm. just by the rotations. Mm -hmm. They have everything that they need. The perfect setup in the post plant. This is going to be so hard for TSM. They still have Zoe on the breach. They still have blinds, but look where Benita is. She's coming in behind them. A huge player in this round, Chobo has the crossfire swinging out for one, looking for more, and TSM's on the trades, but Benita up top, the flank cold of TSM, he's either mid or in B right now. Left. Oh, that's huge for Animal, out comes the Bucky from Emily, damage, no kill, Animal for two. Emily again forced to retreat, but look, they're already on site, they're already fighting, Zoe's here, but only finds a pick, this could be match point, and it looks like it.
as Emily is forced to clutch a 1v3. We've seen Kath do it before her. But Emily needs to and step Zoe. it up. I mean, Zoe, too. Emily needs her turn. She needs to come into this. Out comes the showstopper. No, my God, it doesn't connect, but she still has two. The frags for Emily. The last horde's main. She can hold the spike to half, but she has the wrong read coming up behind her. And this could be all but over. It is. Rise shuts down the champ. Any sense. So they have to just be better. How did we lose this round if we're TSM? We had all the information in the world we were ready every tsm player was towards b and middle and still we're losing all of our fights we're at match point for clg and tsm really does not have the right book here as a read against clg yeah and here comes benita she is feeling it now she's just charging in with the reina emperor she's an unstoppable force just sending it all the way towards defender side spawn athena shows herself down in hell and shobo gives some damage away Benita, trying to fight from the flashes though from Zoe. Into the heavens, they come, they have to go big, they have to live here. But Benita is still finding frag, so is Chobo, taps away for one. And Zoe has asked the impossible. A one versus five, just a judge, very little utility to work with. She has the stun to keep them away, but has to push into a slow... And CL on the attacking side this time around, while Ariana is making a really big push here onto the spawn, utilizing Sky's ability and fighting CLG cool. up in the opposite side of the map and getting three kills out of it. Yeah, that's huge from TSM, starting off strong. They're good at pistols, but this is impressive. They're continuing to press the advantage, but these players from CLG are so boxed in. There's a Sage on one side, locking them in, and Athena's there as well, soon the support from Ari, and the push is continuing to come up. Look at that Viper wall as well. This continues to cut them in, allows TSM to cut the angles even closer, and they make it flawless. All below the tube, a frenzy in hand. She wants to fight Athena. Athena is not quite ready for it, so CLG they pick up too. The wall ready for the plant. This is clearly a set play. This is something they've planned. They're ready for yeah. it, and now they have a good advantage. And they know that Ari usually plays where she is right now, so let's see if they can capitalize on that intel. But Benita, you know, they're just giving up all of B main, and it's working out, getting control of that kitchen here and fighting towards the tube under it, inside of it. Seems to be paying off as Zoe is trying to get her fight of her own. Everybody falls and CLG winning. So many agents here can be key, but CLG is gonna get the plant. Spike is down and Shobo gets the double, utilizing Benita's. Oh, her own recon, actually. Scratch that. It was Shobo taking the Sova out of Benny. I'm so confused, me a little bit. What? I know. You know, these players, they can do whatever right now. Yeah, it's into a three-on-three three here. The wall keeps one side, one rope off limits for TSM. They want to fight into this, but Naomi has head first frag onto Ari, but the Bucky from Athena still finds one. Chobo's up above, finds the first frag, and Naomi pushing to push up and use the Viper utility to find herself space, but Benita finds just over the line, one onto Kath. Now it's going to be CLG advantage, but look where Ari is with the Judge. Great spot, great push. There's another in close on her, but she's going to be forced away for now. So he's clearing space with the dog up through middle. Taking her time here. Emily is kind of getting antsy, shotting the wall, and she's going to get one and gets treated by Zoe CLG. A two versus three situation. Not the best situation to be in. And they're getting flanked by Irie here. 50 they seconds are. left, though. So still a lot of room to play with. Ari loves the flanks. The extremities are her home on this map. And every second that passes means the flank comes closer and closer. Yeah. Rise finds one, but still, where is the flank in this? It's coming up now, and the perfect time to stop the spike plant. And Manson, look how quick Emily is up, but she ooh, doesn't connect. Still alive somehow. But the flank yeah. from behind, however, TSM is getting everything here. Two picks. Naomi, backline, Zoe for one. So into a four on two, Chobo trying to bide her time, hide behind the ramp. TSM have relented the aggression for now. Have her look where Ari is. Up so aggressive. This wall means that she could be anywhere. Rise has no idea. And now her retreat will show the committal at least the thought 
to head towards the A site, but look at the Seeker's stuff. That's going to give all the information TSM need if they want to close this. And CLG Red really doesn't seem to be able to stop the aggression here from TSM. And once again, time is running low, and Ari trying to make it play. She's going to fall, but just the fact that she was spotted is going to cause that little bit of a doubt here onto CLG's mind. And they're going to have to force this eight bomb side as Shobo in a higher position is going to do. Going to be the first one to entry, but Kak here says no. Rise, can she win a one versus four at this point? Ten seconds or a little more, and she finds first frag. Again, Ari, a factor on the flank. No time left. She has to go to the knife. She has to run up. And a Viper's Pit available, as well as a Resurrection. But now, one player's gone. Benita has a great line to take care of Kat on her aggressive push. But here comes the Pit. That forces them off of B and through the smoke, Benita. It's one on to Ari. So now, TSM in a tough spot. But Zoe on the refrag. Ooh. I wonder if Benita overextended here. She was feeling it, but Earth, that is giving a lot of room for TSM to come back into this round, Mimi. They really are. A 3v3 now, a resurrection on both sides, but might not be directly usable. There comes the lockdown. Chobo up top, resurrection for Ari. TSM is committing, but where's Chobo? Good for one. Animal on the back, she finds two as well. This is a two on two now, this is so close. And the Killjoy Lockdown still bides time, almost attained, but no, Athena is still in it. They have a wall for the post plant. This could be huge with the Swarm Grenades by time. However, Animo behind the box gets one. She has to stick on to this, and the Swarm Grenades find it, and will be forced away for the moment. Athena in position, looking for a shot onto one. The trade's through, though, from Ari. And here comes the Snake Bites to, again, force him away, but it doesn't even matter at this point. Spikes down, post plant established. Flank a factor. There's two TSM players there, and the wall can cordon off where the spike is planted. What can they do from the back lines? Emily ready. The cat falls on the site. Great angle, but can't find the shot cleanly. And Emily, now this game is given away. They know they're up the flank, and CLG, they have they're split. They have to fight two angles. And onto the site, Ari, trying to peek through the wall, gets one onto the back of Yellow Animal. And she's continuing to push, but doesn't find the frag. Zoe now in a dire situation and cannot do anything. CLG, two in a row now to play here. And look at this through mid. This is so aggressive from CLG, pushing up TSM. They're ready for this, but it's one for one, and the resurrection has an opportunity to come through. However, Benita still charging in. She is leading from the front as she gets her girls onto the site. Now TSM. 3v5 in the retake. Smoke off. Benita still getting aggressive, holding the dark cover. <laughs> Athena on the other side. And Athena picks it up still. CLG, they hold the vantage. Gotta, gotta upgrade the skin real quick. Get more ammo into the bank as well. And Gaff on the flank flubs the shots, looking for it. She'll get it. But now she's known. And now they can be ready for her. Naomi down below. Snake Bite doesn't hit, and the shots won't either. Athena gets her again. Annie Mall, one of the last two standing, gets one, though. Now on the spike. Viper Wall cutting them off for the moment. So little time. CLG peeking out, and they get the kill. So haven't found a solution at all. And it could happen again, because CLG's already up the site. And they find the opener. Naomi almost on the spray transfer, but Rise is there to aid her. Athena wants to fight. They don't want this in a post fight, but it's happening again, Steph. Repeatedly, CLG posture themselves well. Cat does find one, though. And a resurrection in play could be impactful, but the wall keeps them away. Keeps it slow. Cat wants to push up. There comes the res. Cat up top now, looking for something, but there's a player lurking, waiting directly below her, and she'll strike. That's Annie Mall for one. The Seekers are up, but they're not giving the information. Ari, aggro for one, can't find another. Chobo has to trade, and Zoe's on the site. So is the rest of TSM, but they're still being dissuaded off the site. Sage alive in the back lines. Annie Mall for wow. one and two. How did she get that many there? How did at each other yeah. roles reverse attackers defenders and Ari's in the dark cover could go huge here one No, not even a second that could be it. That's so unfortunate But now Athena has a line. This is this is such a weird round as you say it They're all the way in snowman flanking on to B. Athena just has a specter Ooh, it still gets a shot. It's rough though a second as well Athena that's massive from her Emily helps out but still dancing around the wall over to the pistol and Rise finds it, but she takes so much damage as a result. Left in the clutch here. CLG. 
in a tough spot. The boom, but he's chasing her, and so is TSM. Third other times, and this pistol round is going to be huge. But Emily opens it up with the nade up above. The raise is over. Distracts Rise enough for Kath to have it. So plant down early on, and look at who's still alive—a viper in the post plant. But Benita still does damage. Takes care of Emily. Any Maul ready on this retake. Benita still alive up top. Wants something here. But the wall makes him only able to go up one way. They have to break that at some point this round. CLG trying to fight their way in. Spots out one, but the dash away. Lear to continue the pressure to continue to allow them to force into this. And so he takes care of Naomi. But Benita actually good for three in the round thus far. A two on two. And Animal another. But Ariana is still alive. Will the Viper... It didn't hit. It didn't hit, Steph. It's over. That's it. CLG Red, they have the pistol. Gain some ground because CLG is running away with this game. Yeah, they are. They're in a great position. But Kath this time gets the opener into the round. Naomi falling away has swarm grenades to stop a plant that might be coming. In mid though, Chobo deals with Kath. Naomi still on the other side of the wall. Remember those swarm grenades to keep them off here. Ooh, I thought this was going to connect them to Ari, but she loses most of her health, but stays alive and loses the battle versus Benita. We're going to be in another retake situation. That's the story of this game so far in Ice Block, Mimi. It is the story. And here comes CLG on this retake. Rise through the smoke, and TSM contends with it. This is CLG's side in the ends of Benita coming in really early into this round, and she gets the first blood again against MLE. Not lucky today. No, Emily, I mean, that's a huge factor, that she hasn't been having a good game for TSM. I mean, she's normally that player that's, that we can see at the top of the scoreboard, that we can see popping off, but it might be Naomi here. She gets one, traded through by Ariana, but Athena is up as well, ready. Chobo trying to push in and dies for it, but Annie Wall is ready as well. No, Athena doubles down. Now she's close to the resurrection. Now she can find the site. Benita walled off the op. Won't be a factor quite yet. Can she fit through this gap? No. Not quite. So they're forced up towards heaven, and Ari is alive. She has her utility in the post plant this time. She needs to be able to hit it. She needs to be able to find it. Now, I wonder if she's going to go for a flank here, or she's going to stay to clutch that round again with her Viper utility. But Benita, we are in her eyes. We are hoping for her to get a quick pick if CLG wants a shot at this game utilizing the leer she's gonna swing out and just get early. on it right away yeah she's she holding here. here they don't have her off she's holding all the way down the viper is there but she has the time no athena shuts it down the last second so much work for both teams this is what i like to see yeah i love to see it here benita on the peak out tsm fine too here comes the seekers though and there goes clg Path readies herself. She's the first up to bat. No, it's Emily charging on in up top, above. And she finds Animal for free. A second for Emily. Now she's hitting her shots. Now she's yes. in the server to play. And DSM, they'll start to fall away into this post plant. Ari looking for something. She finds one. Athena's still on the site, trapped in this position. But she can fight. She can still be a factor here. Chobo. Pushing up, look at the cloud burst, that completely covers Chobo. She's not gonna check, and blindsided by Athena. Athena swings out. It's gonna be on a fake while the rest of it's TSM is rushing towards B. Benita, though, giving much more ground for them to get into the side. Is she gonna keep that line of sight? And she does, she gets the first kill while we're still on Emily. It's happening, the action all across the map, left and right. And Benita wants if to she stop stops that plant. spike web. Can she do it? No. Oh. TSM. Now they have a post plant. They've done everything right. And CLG has to clutch it. Emily's lurk still finding frag. She has three already. And Rise is the last woman standing up on top, diving into the depths of the smoke. They know she's in there. They want to hound her out. That TSM attacking side. They're at high point here. Oh, there's Benita getting aggressive and dismissing it away. Take some damage on her way out for the troubles but TSM have so much space they have most of B site barring the site itself Benita still a factor in main and that, look at that's where the spike is Steph 
If she gets the spike down here, that could be huge. But no, Ooh. Zoe fights out. So does everyone else. TSM doing everything but Annie Mall for two. Another chance for one. And she has support in. That's Chobo. They're making this work. Zoe has to clutch. She's done it before. She'd have to do it again. The Seekers are up. Spam through. She peeks out. Quick shot from Zoe. Still a minute on the clock. She knows exactly where her opponent is. Chobo bides her time. She's looking for something. Recon. Great information. Now the peek up from Zoe. And she cannot do it. So, so close. She has one better. A judge. Holding a line. <laughs> They're pushing right into her. They, they lazily check on it. And she can dismiss away. But she goes right into Zoe's hands. Kath catches Animal. She wanted to be a hero again. She wanted to push. And now CLG has advantage. Chobo wants a shot, wants to deny the plant, deny the post plant, and the span's good to find Athena, but still one escapes. And still, the one who escapes is Ari. That's huge that she's alive in a post plant. She has her mollies. They have to go quickly to nullify the Viper utility. Zoe, in the smoke, she's holding close off of yellow Chobo, wants to come in here, but no one's playing in. No one's playing on the site. They just need to stall for time. And TSM, they need to go quickly. Zoe's so low, has to peek out. TSM 1 and CLG, that's Naomi for a couple. Coming up behind Kath, the last standing. Wants to fight this, but the time so low. Is there enough? Get creative, because this is probably the most important round of the series. And TSM, they find the opening. Pick Emily. Again, she's sending herself quickly upwards. The Seekers to allow her that space in. He's in the back line. She only has a Bulldog and Animal down low as well. Emily going crazy. She gets one frag on the opener CLG now down three to five and this time TSM are holding the site they're holding tight Chobo stunned she's in the open a terrible position but she's spared for now through the cloud burst Chobo will find Zoe Benita though up top they can crunch onto the players on site Emily needs something here he needs to keep going Chobo pushing all the way up Emily now in this dark cover they're defusing, but she's gonna come out, and she could come up huge one for Emily, looking for something more, but it's awkward in the smoke. Rise trying to really, really hurt CLG's retake. So if you want to play defense, you have to solidify that map control. At least Rory does damage, doesn't stop the plant though. Athena has it in the ground. There is, however, an alt in play, and there's a frag advantage for TSM. Here comes the lockdown. Still let them on the site. They know they need to go fast because, again, that Viper is always in play. Always a threat running away. Just the narrowest lines up top now. Chobo stunned by the dog. And Emily for one. Now she's peeking out so blind. CLG, they want overtime. They want this. And Zoe might be working on it. Rise for one. Animal, another. And now it's Rise across the board. 2v3. They're so close. Point right here, right now. Yeah, early. It's aggressive up for CLG. Rise in the sewers, but TSM's out long, and they get two picks into it. Rise, though, up this fast flank. She's completely behind them. They're still ready. Annie Malt now trapped in the corner here. She needs more, and she'll get two before she retreats for the moment. But look towards Z, Steph. That wasn't, yeah. even, that wasn't even the committal. CLG's gone. CLG is completely gone. I couldn't see if that's when the push happened that they decided to leave completely but animal is gonna clear that a and everybody is gonna realize the spike is over towards c but we have a garage play here let's see if clg is gonna try to retake this as the drone is gonna gather from some intel animal is gonna get spotted mimi this is a really tough retake for clg yeah, this is going to be a hard one for them. It is the 2v3, though, and Naomi's so blind, can't find the shot. It's just Animal, and she can't even muster a single frag at that point. Disaster is CLG is not careful. It could be, and it's looking like it. Benita gets one, but she actually sprays down for two and escapes as well. This is really important for CLG that they win this round, and now it looks a little more likely. They hold on to advantage. They can heal Benita up. But look where Animal is. She's really ahead, and I don't know... Atina probably heard that. No, it doesn't seem like she knows. So TSM is just going to regroup here and make their way towards A. But there's so much info here being gathered by Animal, as you mentioned. She's ready and reading the rotate. And she's telling CLG, you know what? All back to A. This is where the action is going to happen. So a lot of traps, though, in A. This is... This is TSM just falling apart here as they're trying to get to the site. Spike is going to get planted. Emily, though, is going to fall right away with Naomi pushing into the site. CLG taking their first round 
of this last map. Map number three here. One to two for is a factor, and that's known. The spray through the smoke off the tripwire, good for Naomi. They haven't planted in a good position, but the retakes in quickly. CLG find a couple and Athena, the last on this flank. They should know about her. No, they're not ready, but she gives it away, shoots, and they're holding the spike down. Gets one, but it's not going to be enough to convert the round. CLG, they'll find it in the retake. Really, really good play here by Killing Cat. This plant, this spike was planted. A little bit of intel to stop a push from CLG. Look at Emily really connecting, yeah. I mean, she's she's very sneaky in this corner. Athena won't see her. CLG, player down. And now Rise recovers that into advantage. Emily's gone. Ari wants the refrag, but isn't given the chance. Actually breaks a tripwire there as well. And one cypher up towards long of each site. Chobo in a position here. She can find something, but Athena will edge away. Over on the other side on the pip. We see that CLG Red have a player down C Long as well. Opposing sights, opposing sides, but the ultimate comes out towards A. Chobo still in short. Cover going out. She could have a great flank here. She could have a great chance. So he's ready for a fight though. Here comes the first. Benita gets it. The trade through elsewhere though from Ari. Now the Cypher working a flank up and so might be Ari. Hunter's Fury up. Catho planting in an unexpected spot. But here comes Chobo. Gets one. The trade good from Athena. From Graffiti. She knows there's one's heaven. Doesn't see him quite yet. Benita now has the information. That's the ping. Flank coming through from the Cypher. But so is it from Ari. She's ready for it. Naomi, that's the flanker she needed to go big and she can't. And Ari, there's so many towards C. Nowhere to run. Hunter's Fury up for cast. This is the hallmark of the execution. Animal in a close angle. Flashes both ways. And the kills do as well. Run it back for nothing. But Benita has a great flank to find so many TSM. They rotate again. They always do. They always shift it. But Kath might be getting greedy. And Benita's here for the swing. She's ready. But Athena is more prepared. 2v3 now. They're stopped in middle. They're waiting for a chance. And now the information goes both ways. Neural Theft for Neural Theft. Chobo has the off, And she gets the first. Another chance. And Chobo gets it as well. CLG. Another. It's A, but Animal with that wall is just going to stop it. And potentially gets the double. Yeah, she gets one. Trying to peek in again. Another chance. Judge tacking away. And Naomi gets a couple frags of her own. Half has a spike, she'll retreat towards mid. That's where Zoe's already waiting. And the knife out for Benita. Oh my god, how did Zoe not get that? But Kath, she will. She'll fix the mistakes. Still, a 1v4, just a sheriff. And this feels a little too tall to ask. She does have a 1v1, though, with Rise if she heads towards C. But no, she's working her way sneakily here. Looking for a backstab on the B site. And Chobo's not looking, no one's looking. We get a free kill here, but she won't. Naomi, ready for it. CLG red. Now they're up to two in a row. Storm the op in hand as well, but not finding the shot. She only has one left. An updraft over, and in comes the Hunter's Fury as well. Nothing connecting quite yet, but here comes Zoe through the smoke. She's contended with instantly. That's huge for CLG on this retake. Through the smoke, though. TSM, they spam away. And the trade-up from Naomi, a resurrection as well to put CLG at advantageous odds. CSM in the backline, Emily holding. But a cloudburst covers her. Only eight shots. She needs to find multiple. Good for one. The dash straight in. That was a mistake. That shouldn't have happened. And the defuse will come through. No! Shock darts in time. This is doable. Already half. They need to get her off the spike. Good for the first, but the fuse comes through. Kath got it so, so... Chobo again with the op, and again with a shot. Mm -hmm. She, I mean, she's doing so much for the team because she's finding entries with the op, like every other round. She's putting TSM down a player so quickly, and while they're good at rotating, they're good at getting sights, they've struggled to hold on to the post-plant staff. And they haven't. That's usually CLG's not forte. <laughs> Which is to not really be able to handle these both plans. But Shobo really challenging for a long time here at that long. She already got a pick, so after she got Cloud Bursted away, she's going to focus her attention onto that sewer while the rest of the SM is just gathering a little bit of map control. I don't think they're going to go for this A play. They're just no. wanting to push Shobo back so that she is denied information. Look where Naomi is, though. 
They don't have to rotate C because they know she's up aggressive here. Will TSM check it? That's a question of the hour, Naomi. The timing on this is so key. Oh. She peeks out and drops at the worst possible second. Now the trade's elsewhere, but on the site, that's what matters. And Zoe takes care of the opera. She's spreading this deceit. She's making CLG want to stay. But Rise drops down, still gets the pick. Emily wasn't ready. 2v1 now for Kath. A clutch on hand. She has a Hunter's Fury and a Shock Dart. A pair of those to boot. Going towards now Long now. This time, CLG Red doesn't have four bodies to play against her, Mimi. It's going to be difficult for the girls. They tap the they tap the spike. Here comes the first shock dart. Here comes the Hunter's Fury. She's using this all very early. Push coming through. She hits the kill, but not the necessary one. <gasps> Bonita finds it. Pushing down. She makes the play necessary for CLG to pick up the round. Just pushing TSM away. And I think it's because they don't, they don't have any flashes but a paranoia. They're struggling to get rid of her. And again, she finds the opener. Even a second for Chobo. She's unstoppable on the off. And Benita, over toward short as well, picks up one. Now they're continuing to push, continuing to hound her. And they'll find the kill. But still, Chobo's not far behind. Now she's on a rifle. And Zoe, 1 HP. Hardly anything to work with. Half alive, though. We're going to have to see a beautiful retake once again from CLG Red. We have a flanker this time. It's kind of getting awkward because I do think that Kat is going to get behind the flanker. So I, I don't think that Zoe is going to be aware of that, but she's going to get she's going to be the better woman pushing into CD spawn. Here comes CLG the is getting Here comes the shots. CLG's, they happen yeah. at they, they could stay on this. No, the shot are denies. Now it's a 1v1 for Kat. She's tried this before. They're holding, holding down. The time isn't there though, just by points. You so, onto the last map. Yeah, but this is very aggressive. A will be the hollowed grounds again of this pistol around. Flash up, what? Chobo just went right past Ari. She's still here, but the swarm arrives. Emily, flank, good. Oh no, she whiffed the shots. Now she has to fight away. They know she's here now. That was CSM's chance to regain even standings. Now the spike is down. They have to get rid of Emily, though. So they'll probably elect to fight her here. She's holding in sewer. She knows that. Waiting for support from the rest of TSM. And they're in position, but still. Emily in a tough spot. Flank starting to come through to affect her. She's trapped here. Now Athena, backlines pushing up. The coordination, great from TSM. They hit it at the same time, but Emily dies for it. Now a 2v2, one in hell. Athena gets it. Benita, last standing. She's so impactful, but oh. can she do it this time? No, goes to the shock. Not expecting Athena in close. And TSM, again, they, they've pulled out, I think, all but one or two pistols in, in, in this yeah. entire series. They're so good at that. Yeah. And now they have advantage with the spike down. You need to hold him towards long. There's a flank coming. She hears it. Ready and close for one. Almost a second. Just damage on to Zoe. Zoe now trying to push up. But Chobo, the gun we talked about that was recovered. She's everywhere. Does work. She, I mean, she is. She's doing so much. Now Ari trying to work in. Kath from the back line with one with the Spectre. This shouldn't be CLG's round. But they're making it convincing. TSM down to two players working in. And now they have it even. A two versus two. No shock darts in play this time. But a Cypher cam is waste more time and up comes chobo still fighting still finding something and look how they're playing this game long she has a judge this is not the weapon and chobo has four in the round hello show guilty to connor back that cage play this is a little bit awkward here you hate to see it when both players are against the wall cat though i think is still in the favor position against Chobo. as soon as this wall is gonna break oh, the timing we'll see if chobo is gonna See, they're cat getting the double. This time, CLG doesn't have a res, and Emily is trying to trade off that kill, but unfortunately for her, her angle is a little bit off, and Animal is going to be able to run away. But look at Naomi in B left. right now. She might have a great flank. She does. Yeah. That's Athena, but will she expect a second up in the window? Well, now she knows. Ari's there. Naomi can't muster the fight. Ari, another shot for her. She's keeping TSM in advantage. Animal has to clutch, no wall to play with, 10 seconds. I th she has to go B at this point, left. or she has to hold on. No, she can double back C, but that's exactly where Ari is. This this round is over. Yeah, Ari really playing the... Yeah, but I mean, there's only four rounds away. It is doable. And look at Emily, she's dashing up, and no! <gasps> Animal wasn't blind! And she gets it instantly, not even a lick of damage. Cap has to trade back, though, with the Hunter's Stand Fury. But they kind of want to keep going here, it looks like. The dart's up. Animal looking for it, and it won't give her any information. But now there's one player into the par pocket, that's Zoe. You want to spam away. 
and get something. Adult Hordes A as well, TSM, they're winning that. They have great numbers here. And a 4v2, Chobo, down long. You know, she's here. Will Zoe swing? Will Zoe fight this? She doesn't need to, but she could. She will, and she'll win it cleanly. That's Spike down. And Benita, she is trapped away on the other side of the map. I, do, you even, do you even go for this? I mean, you try to drop as many players as you can just because you can't win this. Well, you can't do some damage. I, I'm not sure I like CLG's adjustment here. After they were really lucky in this initial push, killing Emily, not losing any player to that Umther's Furry. I didn't like that CLG didn't reset out of it and they didn't capitalize on the round, at least a low buy, trying to go with the knives here. With Shobo, she's been doing a lot of work, so let's see if she can win this Antaiko. And Spike is going to get planted right away for CLG. We'll be happy about that. We take an order now. Ari the first to blind out. It should be another kill, but there's actually a blind in response as well. CLG don't have a lot of chances in this, but Ooh. that might be a little more doable now. They have two frags. A 3v3. Kath peeks out. Eats some damage. Now she knows where one is, but she has teammates on the site. Suspects Benita. Hunter's Fury up, though. Kath can hunt oh. this, but no, she doesn't expect anyone. She knew she was there. What happened? This is sloppy from TSM, and they could lose it as a result. Athena trying to hold on to the spike. Shock Dart's getting her off. Benita for that. This is terrible for TSM because they could they could lose this right here, and they might have to. Emily forced away, holding on to the off. They just got ecoed. There was no investment from CLG, and that's 11. That's 11, and this could be high point. Fury. No denial. Kath has a great spot, though, in Garage if she needs a kill. And she can't get it. Naomi quicker. She had the crosshair placement, but no shot. CLG, they have one inside, that's Rise holding, and who's quicker? It's Athena, and Emily as well, one with the op, another, but no, the trade through, Naomi gets it, so a three on three, but look where Zoe is, down long, she can make herself a menace here, she can keep them flushed out, the resurrection though, brings Chobo back into play, and TSM, they need to fight quickly, and pinch the site, but Naomi goes huge, three already, in the round for her, Athena backline trying to fight, she knows there's another one, but can't find the shot, so Chobo wins it, it's just Zoe to keep it off match point, to keep them in this, to keep a chance. And to do as much as they can to win time and kind of let CLG use the timer and run out of time. Uh, they, they, need to, they need to make a change here. Emily, body blocked on the dash. So some damage exchange going both ways. CLG Red, they're playing a default. Sweating TSM out. This is what they excel at. Emily towards long. Wants an early pick. Naomi in the pocket though. She could go big here. One frag. The second as well. CLG, they could do it right here. There's another one behind her though. They could get her. That's Ari. She'll find it. But still advantage lies with CLG. And they're redirecting towards the C site. No one can deny this plant. It has to be a retake at disadvantaged odds. Yeah, and if Benita is able to get control, keep control of that flank, like this could be oh, huge. And no. she gets the first kill onto Ari. She is bringing pressure back by Kat. Now it just Kat has to be now. her. Yeah, tremendous amount of work here. She needs to win a one versus three. Can she do it, Mimi? I don't know. It's going to be so hard for her. Her team's life TSM on the line, but she can't.